Thank you. Good afternoon, everybody, and um, welcome to just a quick police briefing in regard to the 2019 Royal Adelaide Show. Uh, from a South Australian police perspective, we just want to uh, highlight a couple of factors. But, uh, the first one is that this is a uh, family and fun event. It does involve children, and uh, first and foremost on our minds is safety. So I can reiterate, please, to the public that um, South Australia Police will strictly be enforcing the speed restrictions around the Royal Adelaide Showgrounds for the entire duration of this event of the 10 days. So I do ask the public please to be mindful of that in regard to the 25 kilometre per hour road restrictions. Secondly to that too please is remembering that this is a uh, child event with a very strong focus on children and safety. So um, in conjunction with the Royal Adelaide Show there are wristbanding for I'm Lost for Children that will be available and we do encourage parents and carers to make sure that they do wristband their children or those they're looking after in the appropriate manner and if not when you come in the gate seek some advice and find out and that way we can always reunite very very quickly lost children and lost parents for that matter. What are some of the biggest issues that police face come showtime? Uh, look for us it's the volume of people we do expect some good sized crowds this year obviously with the great weather coming so uh, we will focus on behaviour and uh, um, rest assured that uh, any bad behaviour won't be tolerated and people will be shown the door. Police will be on horseback, on bikes and on foot. Just talk us through the, the visibility. Yep, there'll be a very, very high visible presence of uh, uniform officers on the horses as behind me. Inclusive of that is our bicycle patrols both inside and outside of the showground. With particular attention, as I said, to the roads and the road policing, but also to our uh, neighbouring suburbs in regard to crime that may occur just with the sheer number of people that move around the showgrounds. So when, you, when you say that sort of crime, can you go into a bit more detail about what you usually see at showtime? Well what we do traditionally see is we encourage people to lock vehicles, make sure that valuables are out of sight or not in the car in the first place. Let's not encourage or give people opportunity to take that opportunistic crime of theft. So we do see some rises in theft around this time of year and that the same goes for inside the showground. Take care of your valuables, keep them safe. If you've got concerns, please make an approach to one of the uniform officers or security and discuss it with us so we can take positive action. Is much of it petty crime? Is that what you have to deal with, pickpocketing? Not so much pickpocketing, but people do take opportunity with theft when we've got sheer numbers of people here. <laughs> Every time. Every time. Chief Inspector, just with the, the speeding on the roads, I guess people using these roads the other 51 weeks of the year um, and coming off the back of Operation Safe Speed, which I think ends today, the Fatal Five still running. Obviously, you'd really want to reinforce that given where our road tolls at at the moment. Absolutely, and the, and the key factor for us with this event is children. We know children of all ages are going to come to the Royal Adelaide Show and we know that they're going to come in and out of and across our roadways. So for us it's about the public stepping up, acknowledging that it's a child friendly event, family event. The 25 kilometre zones are there for a good reason. And there is plenty of pre-warning as there is out there now before the show to tell people that it's coming. We just want people to do the right thing and make it a very, very safe event. What sort of presence can people see at the show police wise? Uh, you'll see an awful lot of uniform officers. Um, they'll be here from 9am in the morning right through to the closing hours as well as inside and outside. Uh, in regard to uh, a high visible police presence and we encourage everybody not only just to look out for us but come and say hello. Have you thrown more resources at this year in particular? Uh, in regard to that we will throw resources around the show as I said around the speeding factor that's an absolute. Are you doing anything different this year with regards to your presence at the show? No, no it's the same presence we're very very happy we must say that the previous year's uh, behaviours have been fantastic People come with the right attitude and make sure it's a fair. Um, rest assured that we'll be watching, along with the security, along with the show organisers, for anybody that chooses to misbehave, and we'll take early action and it'll be firm action. What, what sort of action? Well, the, the normal uh, action is to actually look at what the offending is and, if need be, evict people from the premises.